Undeniable name of Dame will never been a lame. Oh, you already know who it is. It's your boy King Lamar, aka King Els, aka Stop Playing Me for I Slap the Shit Out You. Uh-huh. Yo, get real familiar. This is the boy Jay Willa, and wow. this right here is <laughs> Willa Wednesdays, bro. You about to get some ghetto news from your relationship gurus. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Listen. Listen, right now we, we got do some own guns. Listen, by the way. listen, we, we got Whoa. some we got some important stuff to talk about. Violence. We got some important stuff to talk about. Hit me with it. And I want y'all to talk about it. So NLE Chopper. Press start, bro. In it right here? Start. Got gotcha. you. Damn, damn, Jesus. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Cool. NLE Chopper. Um, he went through a very public breakup. He ain't make public. That he didn't make public. His girl did, but um, the long and short of it is he broke up with his girl because he wanted to cheat in peace, and he could not. I mean, I, I agree with that. You feel me? <laughs> so I, I agree with I, that. I, 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 yeah. I, want, I, want, I want to press play on the video okay. so, so, we, so we can watch it together. Okay. And then we can talk about it. Cool. If I tell you I'm a cheat or whatever, and you say I'm cool with that as long as you take her home, and which I do, I take her home. But the littlest bit of peace where I want to do is where I do my dirt at. Because I let you know that, and you and you approved of it, you signed up for it, you said it was cool. And once I do it, I don't get the peace of mind to do it. Wow. I don't feel free, and I don't feel I don't feel free to who I am as a person. I never saw Freedom, this. being free. And um, I don't see myself having one wife. And that's another thing, Marissa. She was big on marriage. She was big on marriage. So I'm like, I'm like, I I had to let her know, like. It's like we was in two different worlds. And it's like every day I had to bring her back into mine to let her know like, hey, you told me this is what you wanted. This is what you signed up for. You got to stick with it. Yo. Okay. That's the first time I saw that. Okay. So you you guys have both seen this video, right? I, bro, this was killing social media today. Yeah, like today? it was on fire on social media. I didn't see this. So I, I want to go out okay. there and say that wow. his girl he's talking about is around twenty six, maybe twenty seven. How old is he? He's nineteen. He's a nineteen bro. year old young man, and she's a whole decade older than him. What? Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. I've been in a situation like that before. But one thing I do want to say is that half a decade, he is extremely real. Wow. I, yeah. I say that I, I, my, my, my commentary on this young man is that he is very real. And a lot of people might uh, shoot down his ideals or whatever because of his age. But when someone's 40 and they keep it a buck the same way, who have the same amount of money and the same amount of resources. We don't look at it in no type of way. Yeah. We say this is what men, that man wants. He knows himself. Damn. Mm-hmm. This wow. young man knows himself. This young man understands, you know, he believes in polygamy. He understands he might want to have more than one wife. He understands what he feels like his urges are. And he said, look, this is the, the, the contract. You tell me what you expect, and I'll tell you what I expect. Whew. And we go about it from there. And he is living up to his – he's living up to – his side, because she was saying he's a great guy. He did everything. I didn't think that this was going to be my reality. That means that this guy hasn't done anything that he he hasn't, he didn't lie. He didn't go behind anybody's back. He, right. he upheld his side of the contract. The problem is she didn't really read the fine print. So she didn't mm-hmm. really know what she was walking into for real. Mm-hmm. Wow. wow, that's crazy. How you feel about that, bro? I'm gonna ask you first. Cool. Okay. Go first. Um, Go before me, not first. Bro. I'm gonna say this, um, <laughs> and that's why I wish Loki. I wish Sheik was here. I was. Just, like, I, I, bro, I hate that I know what I, you was thinking. Bro, I, I, I wish, in my head, I was like, "Fuck!" Cool. I wish Sheik was here today. I, 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 I wish Sheik was here. Just ju- to have a female just perspective. Just so we can, yeah. Because yeah. what's gonna what's gonna happen is yeah. we gonna get killed in the comments because there's three uh, yeah. guys talking about a situation and now we quote unquote bash it, right? This is obvious. But, female bashing, but what yeah. happens is to me, yeah. Um, wow. We can only get somewhere if we agree to it. Mm. 
if all parties agree, I don't know their story at all. I don't. I don't I'm, yeah, I'm not there. I don't fucking know. Yeah. But watching what she had put and watching what he had put, they had an understanding. Mm. Listen, this is the understanding. This is what's going on. This is what's. This is what I'm about. Can you see yourself attaching yourself to me? She said, yeah. And they continued. So now when I do what I said I was going to do and that I asked you if you were okay with, you cannot, you cannot have a problem with it now because you agreed to it. And now if you do have a problem with it after we agreed to it, I now have a problem with you. And I get that stance. You're going against your word, ma. Because I literally came to you truthfully. Women always say, I, I just want you to be honest with me. Keep it a buck with me. If you want to fuck, just say that. If you want to be with me, just say that. So if you meet a guy and that guy is like, yo, I don't see no future with you, but you have a good time, I have a good time, I'm just trying to kill, you just right. want some good dick for the meantime, we can do whatever we got to do, that's that. We're going to keep it like this and we're going to move forward. You cannot be mad at me if I stick to that <laughs> and your feelings develop into something later. It's, it's like, don't, don't hold me accountable to something that I didn't, I di I didn't agree to that. So I, I can't be held accountable for that. You're not wrong. Neither one of you. I agree with mm -hmm. both of you. I, I agree with him. <laughs> um, you know, men... We, we you you know thing for us is A and B it's logic, yeah. It's one and one is two with us as men. Yeah. Women act like that's what it is. That's a fact. They 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 act like oh yeah one and one is two of course. Until one and Until one, one don't one be two, two no more. Yeah, one and one is seven, <laughs> and you're like, well, how the fuck did that even have a? That's a fact. Um, what I'll say, and I'll go back to what you used to talk about. Just joking. <laughs> Um, I'll go back to what Not you... that. <laughs> no, no. I'll go back to what you used to talk about back in the day. Um, you can't give grade A dick to these women when you know that the grade A is not going to be like what you want to be a part... Okay. You could probably explain it better, but I'll just keep talking about it. What happens is you do have this conversation with the woman, and we know this is true. Yes, I've had this. I, listening to him talk, that's why I was like, I had to like process this. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> because it's like, I've had this conversation. Like, well, yeah, I'm on this type of journey, and this is what it is, and I just need you to understand that that's what the fuck it is, period. That's what it is. And then once you fuck them good, mm. their emotions change mm. as a woman. And you just constant. You knew what you came for. And that's different. Me, as uh, us as men, we like, well, motherfucker, we told you. Can I play devil's advocate? That's crazy. But then you fuck the lights off of them. Once again, that grade A dick that you we get, talk about. You, you can't give grade A. You hit them with that boom, boom, boom. Now boom, they on boom, your phone boom. like. What you doing? What Where you fuck? at? So I. I want to give just slight resistance. Go ahead. Go ahead. Give me no, no, no. I'll go back. No, go ahead. Yeah? Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm going to hit both points. I want to play devil's advocate, right? All right. Because. We don't have a woman that's here, and I'm we, sorry. bro, we always get killed for bashing. So we'll see you next week, she. So what I'm gonna do? She she coming. What I'm gonna do? I'm, I'm gonna give the devil's advocate, right? So devil's advocate is. Uh huh. There's no way you have me feeling this way, and there's no way that you do certain things with me and to me, mm -hmm. and then all of a sudden you just cut me off and just jump to somebody else. There's no way you do that, bro. Of course there is. Ugh. Okay, so, explain. Oof. So, Oof. long story short, <laughs> that was dangerous. Yeah, we need that a woman toxic, in the room. We but that was toxic. Room. Go ahead. By Go. me or you? No, by you. Right? That was toxic. Nah, just the, 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 the slide. <laughs> the transition. The yeah. <laughs> he said, of he course, said, of course, course there is. Like, <laughs> what are you talking about? So, and this is how. Like, okay, talk so to us. In, in every relationship, in every contract, whether it's whatever it is, you have an understanding of the situation. Yeah. You have an understanding of what's expected. You have an understanding of um, what's right and what's wrong in that situation. Yeah. You have an understanding of where the lines are. 
You feel me? In most regular relationships, you don't have that understanding. Most friendships, you don't have that understanding. Most situationships, sometimes you don't have that understanding. And that's where the confusion comes into play because we're assuming the whole time based off our feelings. I feel like we're that close so I can say this. I feel like I love him so I want to do this. I, I feel get like it. she, you know what I'm saying? I get it. There's no real true understanding. But when you have a particular conversation and you're real with someone about who you are, it is a little disrespectful for that person to now agree to it at one point and then and then demand you to change at another. I agree. I it's agree. like it's like it's like yo. You this knew is, what you signed up for. And this is not disrespectful because some people are bashing him because of his age or because of his ideals. And number one, we just have to respect people. Different people have different ideals. And some of, yeah. and I feel like there's yeah. him, him cheating is not even really cheating. You feel me? Cheating is when you're doing something behind someone's back without their knowledge and you are deceiving them. He's not cheating. He's communicating that he wants a particular level of an open relationship. To where I have my main shorty right now, but I like to enjoy other women on the side. Now, that is my only stipulation. Your mm. only stipulation for me will be you don't got to worry about nothing financially, emotionally, spiritually. This is a very spiritual young man. You yeah. feel me? It's a very conscious young man, very healthy young man. Like, his, he's 30 for real. Like, he's 19, but he's, like, really 30. Like, from what I understand. He's been here before. So, I'm going to close it out. He is fulfilling his obligations. Mm -hmm. I saw a post the other day, and uh, we were talking about it earlier. Justin LeBoy posted something to say, hey, trying to catch your man cheating knowing you can't pay bills on your own is crazy to me. <laughs> I want to translate that, right? <laughs> trying to g disrupt the home in some way when you're not ready for the end result of losing that person is crazy to me. Mm-hmm. Shorty knew for a fact that, you know, this is the stipulation. This is what it is. And you kind of going against that or wanting to amend your contract that you signed up for would result in losing him. Uh, and that's crazy to me. Mm -hmm. This is her fault. Go ahead, Dane. But I got to go back to your grade A dick. Oh, I, I can break that down, too. Because, my bad. Well, I just want to say real quick. Before you, let me break that you're, down, you're, too. You're, you're not wrong, but... When you tap into that other part of somebody's physical existence, like, bro, we we done all fucked a girl before, and we was like, nah, we. I violated. You know what like, I'm like, I, I, I shouldn't have did that. Like, like, I, like, come on, bro. I, I violated. You know what I'm saying I got calling her mom like, mama, this is. This yeah, is, yeah, like I violated. This is yeah, thing. yeah. Because the way we, he made we me did that. feel, and, mm -hmm. and, and 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 mind you, we're talking about emotional. Women are emotional. Men could be like, oh, I felt like that, but we logical. We, we mm -hmm. also like, yeah, I mean, I felt like that on Tuesday, but nigga, it's Wednesday tomorrow. You know what I mean? Logically, hey, what's up? We like, hey, it's, it's, it's Wednesday one afternoon. Yeah, yeah. But, but women are like, no, but you changed the way I feel. So, like, they walk into it. Like, I signed your contract. I'm here for it. But then you literally make them feel like, bro. Some shit changed. They're yeah. like, nah, but I ain't know that you was going to. You the we'd all had that girl the Martin joke with the girl that looked back at you like, <laughs> like, like why you fucking you, me like, like this like you, you ever been hitting it and she looked back at you like nigga what the what the fuck is going on? this is different yeah this ain't what we talked about mm. we talked about bum ass condom sex yeah which I always tell you bum yeah. ass like but you're violating so, right now but you are like now so now it's different so as a woman I'm just I'm not I'm, that was, so so um I can't so number one. Because what if you feel that way? Number one, um, people don't always end up in the long run with the person who gave them the best sex. Right? Yeah, of course. The percentage yeah, yeah. of yes, people of actually being in a long-term relationship, married or whatever, with the person who actually gave them that grade-A pussy, grade-A head, grade-A dick, is like less than 15%. Yeah, we you all feel me? for it, though. And it's not, mm -hmm. it's not <laughs> settling when you're in that. It's just that you, you, you get to a point where you understand that a relationship is built off of more than just sex. Of course. It's more than just, yeah, 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 I get it's that. More than just money. It's more than just good conversation. Whatever, yeah. yeah. A relationship has multiple points. So when you're talking about just the sexual aspect yeah, of it, yeah, 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 breaking that wall, 
cool, yeah. but there's more to that. So, yes, now, there are certain people who get captivated by dick or get captivated by sex, but that captivation never lasts. But you I, feel me? That never, that never, when, hear, hear me out. Hear me out. Hear yeah, that's your game. You're not wrong. You're that, not wrong. Oh, my God. That was so great. It never lasts. The reason why I say never lasts is because it's a high. It ends up just being, yep, that was some that was some great sex. It's in the moment for the next, you know, maybe a couple weeks or a month or so, whatever, yeah. or a couple months, you're like, yo, that's really good. I want more of it. But that great sex or whatever is just a high. You know what I'm saying? But when you're talking about actually giving someone your standards and they want to go against the standards that you have that they agree to, mm-hmm. bro, it's over with. You have to, at some point, be disciplined with your emotion or disciplined with Agreed. yourself. No Agreed. matter what. Yo, even if a shorty tell me, look, Lamar, my standard is we could do whatever. You just can't look at other women's ass in front of me. And I agree to that. A month in, I start looking at other women's ass. But you can't do that because you violated her trust. I violated the agreement that we have. Now I can try yeah. to break her down and be like, well, just understand that in a, in a, in a, in a relationship, like that's just something that happens. I'm going to look can, at ass. We can both try to look at the ass together like it's, it's, it's something normal. She can hit him with the, in a relationship, us being only messing with each other, us being a monogamous relationship is something normal that we only need to do and try to change the ideals that Buddy gave her in the first place. Number one, that's controlling in my personal opinion. Mm -hmm. Number two, you're not, and if he no longer wants to go with it, you have to understand when you, when you, when you step to somebody in a relationship about something they're doing and you want them to change it, if you're not willing to compromise or walk away, right, then you shouldn't bring that up. The fucking point that he just made resonates. It, oh my God, let me put my cup down. What happens is, I'm going to follow up. What happens is, something may happen in your relationship. It may happen in your situationship, right? Yeah. Um, something happens you don't agree with. Mm-hmm. Like he said, <laughs> either you're willing to compromise or you're, you're willing to walk away from. Right. What happens is, People don't want to walk away from it. Or the other person's willing to compromise. I can't walk away from it. You're a good person. I'm a good person. I don't want to walk away from it. Right. So all this fuss and this hubbub that I'm kicking up, all this yeah. dust that's being kicked up, it's like it's wasted because I'm not going to put no real action behind it. But, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm not but. Uh, my bad. I'm, I'm starting with but. He but. didn't see her reaction. <laughs> I'm not dealing uh, facts. I'm saying but, but I'm not saying but. Mm -hmm. All I'm trying to say is what makes people stay together is the intangibles. It's not the things that you think that you want and then you get everything that you want and then that just happens and then you got it and then that's the person. It don't happen like that. What happens is you want what you want, you get enough of what you want, but then this motherfucker got some intangible shit that's like, Yo. Oh, you got that too? You got. Okay, wait a minute. I didn't even know that you could do that. Yeah. That's that's what makes you fall in love. That's what makes you fuck with good pussy. Fuck you, me. I I didn't fuck mad women. (laughs) Shut up. (laughs) Do you want to violate? Come on, come on. No, 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 no. I want you to violate. You want to violate? We we, we don't do that no more. Ain't no liquor for you. No, he's about to violate. He's about to violate. What I'm saying is, I've had. Mad good sex with all type of women, all types of shapes and sizes. Uh huh. I've had a lot of women cook for me and and help me write songs and do whatever they do. Like they cook, they clean, they beautiful, they this, they that. No, fuck it. No, the allure is amazing. Your great conversation. They're poets. They're they're Business. artists. They do. I've done. No, I've done a lot of that. But what happens is the the women that grab me is always the women who have intangibles. And what's funny is. The intangibles for me is always, it's kind of like, for me, it's always the women I wouldn't pick. What do you mean by intangibles? Wow. For me. Yeah. What do you mean by intangibles? An intangible is something like you walk out outside the house and you leave your keys in the house. 
you knock on the door, bang, and she's like, here you go. And you're like, damn, you. She just knew that you needed it. How the fuck it. did you know that? Yeah, like, you was upstairs asleep. Nigga. But you just and knew. And she was just like, here come this. That I with the need, yeah. Okay. That it's intangible. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to lie. Because I'm that's not going to lie. That, I agree. It's, I agree. That it's, shit is real. No, but it's just that something shit, about certain women. That shit is real. You can just pick up on the things that you no, no, miss. I do shit like that. Which is, no, no, no. And, 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 and that shit is real, bro. I, maybe, but maybe you the real. intangible nigga. I, maybe she leaving. You like, baby, your keys. Nigga, that's hey, intangible hey. man. Hey, bro. I, what think, what I think I just have higher awareness. But, so okay. certain women I mean, just have awareness. But, like, why would the nigga but you, but, but all right, but I'm not just talking so, about, but I'm not. I understand talking. what you're saying. I understand what you're saying. Okay, because I'm like, it's I ain't gonna make it Help me where no, no, I'm no. weak. But it's like. Yes. But not even help. The fact that you even just see it. Before I knew I needed awareness. help. Awareness. That's wild. But that's not. Okay, okay. Oh, technically, it's awareness. Yeah. No, it is awareness. It's awareness. You're Whoa. not wrong. Okay. But I, I guess I'm baffled let, by the fact that can a I, motherfucker can I piggyback? Can I piggyback? could be like, you about to trip. You trip. You're like, God damn it. Why the fuck? Can I piggyback? Can I piggyback? <laughs> can I piggyback? Can I piggyback? That shit is sexy as shit to me. No, so, as no, a partner, it, it is. to see things but, that you can't see. But that's, no, like, no, but it's, that's it's, sexier than a fat ass to me, To be honest, that's 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 sexier than a fat ass to me, I'm about to bring it home because you didn't see her reaction. I know her reaction. Cool. So let's just keep it to the. Let's keep it to this, right? Do we have her reaction? Here, no, her but reaction. I, I know the reaction. So What was her reaction? Her reaction was, um, <laughs> yeah, she was crying. It was, it was, it was, it was boo-hoo. Didn't think this was my it was reality tears. Because my, my it, reality last week wasn't this yeah, week. So, you have to understand that he was amazing. That because he's young, he's one of the greatest guys I've ever been with. Right. He's such an amazing, Give amazing, amazing, ass, amazing, that amazing. Great amazing. Dick. You feel no. Me? Nah, Listen. he was. It's, it's more than that. Yes, it's great a vegan 19-year-old dick. Okay? <laughs> it's vegan. <laughs> vegan slutty. dick. 19. Slutty. 19. Vegan. Slutty, slutty vegan. vegan. Slutty it's vegan. Slutty hey, vegan. 19-year-old me was wilding. Yeah, no, I was. I was wilding too. I, listen, I, I was back. wilding. Back. I wish I could give. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I Nigga, wish I could give. Nineteen-year-old me, no back pain, listen, bro. Listen. Just all pumps, no back, me, bro. I wish I could give nineteen-year-old me the mind and nastiness that I know and have now. The energy and yeah, the wherewithal. Of nineteen, nah, look, look, look. So, of thirty-seven-year-old yeah. you. Yeah, got period. it. <laughs> so, so look. Nah, but like I got what? a cold three hours for you. I ain't got no three hours, mm-hmm. nigga. You get you. Nineteen? Right. We we don't we don't. We don't need to let them know how much we disappoint. But I'm just saying. <laughs> I hate you, bro. Yo, go, 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 go. You go, won't go. be on 19. <laughs> Every third session is going to be impressive <laughs> as fuck, okay? I am that nigga that you're like, Every oh, third. Whoa. Every third. You can mark the calendar. This nigga is different. Every but third. The, the, Every third the, the two in between. <laughs> Is is get by a dick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're yeah, gonna yeah. get you to the next time because you horny right now. Yeah, but no, no. 19 though, nah. 19, it was every session was danger. What? All right, every session was a. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Tap I'm out. Shutting it down. Now it's man. a. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> it might could have been. <laughs> you either gonna be really face impressed. Tats. Nigga, face tats. <laughs> tats wow. You either really gonna be impressed. Yeah. Or you gonna, or be, you gonna be really, really hoping depressed. for the next impressive session. <laughs> Anyway, man. No, 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 no. All right. No, no. So here's what I'm saying. The reason why I say that um, I point out the fact that she was extremely sobbing mm-hmm. is because she knows she did. She, she, my bad. She, what word? Sobbing. 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 She was crying. Sobby. My bad. She was crying she and was giving sobbing. him praise. She was crying and giving oh, him praise okay. online. Gotcha, gotcha, on gotcha. Twitter and yeah. on Instagram. Uh, okay. She knew that she fucked up. I she mean, knew that she pushed that guy to the point. Now, here's one thing that we don't know. We don't know what does her complaining look like what does his cheating look like what does that process of them look like to where she probably was getting annoyed or he was getting annoyed by her that's what we don't know so we don't know how far either one went yeah but we do know what happened and i know for a fact she regrets it more than he does because he's standing on his morals and she's regretting her situation because he's a great guy that she's going to try to come back to. And he's got I, great 19-year-old morals. I, Those I, is my morals in 19. I'll say this. Nah, I'll nah, say nah. this. I, t- to this. be honest, in closing, I'll say this. Um, When I heard her side of the story, I don't even know her shorty name. I'm sorry. Whatever mm. your name is, cool. Mm. She, no, she, she had like a duck mouth, but Damn. whatever. Damn. But... She sounded like somebody who knew 
that they fumbled the bag. <laughs> Daffy, Daffy Duck. She sounded thousand like, percent. Daffy like, Duck. Like she knew she fumbled she knew the bag. She, fu- That's a she duck thought joke. about the situation this, and was like, "Bro, we're, we're, I didn't have to do that." Bro, how about this? We're looking at the, we're looking at the first facial reaction from NLE. Does he look like he looked like he fumbled the bag? Nah, nah he looked no. like he just has to explain himself. He's like, he's like, yo, let me let me get my shit off, so yeah. everybody else will be cool with my decision. Yeah, it's a real statement, bro. He looks like, yo, I know what I said. I know my pride. I I, I know what I'm worth. I, I told I, sh- I told Shorty what it is. I kept it a buck. She didn't keep it a buck. So with that, she lost. That's what it looks like to me. Right. Yo, you're replaceable. At, at some point, and this and is, that's, this is it's, I'm not it's, trying to be it's, wearing it's a manosphere, tough. niggas, but at some point, everyone has to make a compromise. Mm. And you either know, you either know, you know, what you're willing to and what you're not willing to. Yeah. Certain people, I, I think, me, women are naturally at a certain level of 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 a uh, value that when you're beautiful, when you're smart, when you're just quirky or whatever, you got a certain level of value and men are fighting for you. There's a certain level of, of men that end up surpassing women to where now they are the prize. You feel me? To where if you want a particular men. lifestyle, yeah, if you want a okay. particular kind of guy, if you whatever, there might be some things you have to compromise on. Yeah. And it is easier for a gentleman like NLE to replace a woman like her than then it vice is for versa. her to find another gentleman like an elite. Mm. So, so, mm. It's, so it, it, it's tough. It can hurt, but we all are compromising in life. What are you willing to compromise and stand on? That's all that matters. Dame, take us out, bro. Appreciate y'all for fucking with us, man. Willow Wednesdays, we did it once again, man. Please like, share, comment, hit the notifications, man. We see you next week. Uh, Gangster. We holla. Man, let's <laughs> know. You agree, disagree. My bad. Holla. Bow. <laughs> Whoa. Man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning in to Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the facts, support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Willow Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace.